In this video, we are going to look at basing a local branch on an in-progress review. There are a number of reasons you might want to do this. Maybe the in-progress review is fixing a bug or adding a feature that you care about. But whatever the reason, this is how you'll do it. First, go to the Garrett review. Click the download button. This will bring up a number of commands, and we want to copy the checkout command. Then we'll come over here to our local repo, and we will just run that command. This leaves us in kind of a weird limbo state, so we want to create a new branch with what we just checked out. And now you can see there we are on the in progress branch, and we have the in progress review commit on our local branch. Now we can make a change. And we can see that now our local change is based on the in-progress change. The other way that you might want to do this is if you've already done some work locally and then discover that you want to base it on an in-progress review. So we'll do a quick reset on this one to get rid of our test commit. And then we will check out our previous testing branch. So you can see our test commit is still there. And we can just do a git rebase on our new in progress branch. And now you can see our test commit is based on the in progress commit. So now we can go ahead and git review that. Once again, we're expecting that there will be two commits because we have the in-progress review that has not merged yet, and then we have our new commit. And you can see it only actually pushed our commit because that's the only one we made changes to. Now you need to be careful when you're doing this because if you make any changes to the other person's in-progress review commit, then when you go to do your git review, it's going to overwrite their review with whatever you have locally. Even rebasing your branch will trigger this. So if you need to do that for some reason, make sure you at least talk to the owner of the other commit and let them know that you're going to need to do this and make sure that it won't accidentally overwrite any changes they're about to push. So now we can go back out here and take a look at what this looks like in Garrett. And you can see now we have related changes in a patch series just like when we did our all our own patch series. And you can see we can go over and take a look at our test commit. So that's pretty much it for how you base your work on an in-progress review, and thanks for watching.